you guys? Wake Goblin 115 here from the comic strip 3. Hey, doing pretty good today. And today, I'm a comic book, comic book pickups. Um, these are my pickups from the last two weeks. Uh, last week I only had two books, so it wasn't really that amazing. But uh, yeah, last week I only had two books, and I bought it, and I bought an old book. This week, I had a lot of um, books that were uh, ending. A lot of titles that were ending. Well, not a lot, but. I guess. But, uh, let's get right into it. A very interesting but weird book is Superior Spider Man. I mean, it's Skittle because they're tasty. <laughs> but, Superior Spider Man issue number 19. Uh, I mean, the art was. Good. I wonder why. Stegman. Yes. Stegman is so awesome. Yeah. That was good. Story was good. His face looks like an alien there, but oh well. But a good book. Guardians of the Galaxy issue number seven. This was a really good one. I just like forget what happened because the last issue came out like a month ago or a month ago, so. I mean, so I forgot what happened. So I either have to uh, read the last issue, or I have to read the previously. But uh, I remember what happened in this one, so I didn't need to do any of that. If I can eat this little last piece of skittle, then I won't sound like I have a lisp. Um, nom, 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 nom. Okay, so a really good book. I am gro. That's all I gotta say. <laughs> It's pretty funny because there, there were, uh, I think, like one part. It was just funny when he said, "I am grow," you know. But uh, good issue. Art is really good in this one. All right, so those are the only two new books that I got last week. Here's the ones from this week. I didn't really notice that, but it says Ramos at the end. I don't know, maybe he did the penciling or whatever. But the art was okay in this. Uh, Superior Carnage was actually Superior Carnage, and it was pretty good. I enjoyed it. Um, it wasn't as good as the first one. The first one was really good. Um, so, I mean, I kind of thought it was going to be like this, this kind of entertainment. Um, he looks really epic in this cover, but it doesn't look like that in the comic. So I wish he looked like this in the comic. But uh, a good book overall. Alright, uh, Spirit of Spider-Man Team-Ups, issue number 5. This was a good one, and it's kind of funny because... It's the Sinister Six, and you're like, oh my god, where's Dr. Octopus? He's right there, you know? <laughs> right? But, um, they used a lot of the stuff from Ends of Earth, or a lot of the villains from Ends of Earth, or all the villains, all the villains from Ends of Earth was actually, um, in this. The ones that they kind of, like, kept in those containers, I think. Yeah, container things. But a good book, I like it. Number five, issue number five, really cool cover. I really like that cover, actually. Alright, here's a book that I believe this is the last issue of, um, Ultimate Comics All New Spider-Man issue number 28. I believe this is the last issue, and it was a good last issue. I really, really enjoyed it. Um, sad to see it go, but I'm happy to see it go, because I did not like when it started. So, I can't say I'm heartbroken about it, but, I mean, it was a good read, and it was a good book to read. But it's not really over, because there's another, like, mini kind of series. I'm going to pick the first issue of that up, but I don't know what I'm going to do with the other issues but it was a good book overall sorry about the glare on the top my light it's pretty sexy i know but um anyways venom issue number 42 i'm about to cry right now <laughs> no but i'm kidding but i'm not um issue number 42 amazing issue guys amazing issue i really enjoyed it i thought it was a good last issue i thought they kind of left it off where they could it could come back but it's not going to, at least for the next three million years. But, um, a good issue. Now, guys, in the back of this issue, the writer, I'm just going to open it up and show you. Yeah, this is the next book. It's from issue number 79. Yeah, yeah, I'll get to that later. Just calm your wits. In the back of this book, I'm opening the book up, as you see. The very back of this issue, you can see that good. Oh, uh, and in the very last page... 
right here where it says where, where he will return. Right here, read that. I don't care if you think it's long or whatever, read that. It is like, some of it is spine tingling at the end. Because he says, although I might be done writing Venom, I'm not done with symbiotes. Stay tuned. I'm not quite done with symbiotes. Stay tuned. But you got to read the whole thing, guys. If you had this issue and you didn't read that yet, um, pick it up right after you watch this video and read it. Because it's like, it's pretty cool. So read that. So that's all the new books I got over the past two weeks. And here are the old books. I got two new old books. This is number 69 or 79. Sorry. I don't know what the heck's going on. But um, this is a really good issue. I liked it better than 68 with the first appearance. It was really good. Um, if you get if you get, uh, get this for cheap, definitely get it just because it's a good read. But uh, but uh, yeah, I just noticed this. But his cigar is on his mouth. Maybe it's supposed to be falling out, or maybe that's not even a cigar. I don't even know. I'm pretty sure it's a, it's a cigar, but it's kind of weird. It's in pretty good condition. Not as good as uh, uh, 78, but um, yeah, it's a good issue. To the prowler, no more. Next issue is the Amazing Spider-Man 26. Yes, um, this looks washed, washed out because of the light, but it's not. See, it looks really washed out because of the light. I don't know if the other ones look like that, but anyways. Um, it's a really good issue, guys. Um, it's the first appearance of Crime Master, and Crime Master actually dies in 26, which is kind of funny. But of course, he returns. Right? Yeah, he returns. Yeah, I'm pretty sure he returns. Maybe he doesn't. Yeah, yes, he does. He turns into Venom. Um, Green Goblin looks really, kind of weird. His face kind of looks a little bit fatter than his body. Um, the bat. Guys, sorry about that. Um, but anyways, it's fine. But anyways, um, what I was saying is that his face looks weird. Crime Master died. Um, but yeah, I'm pretty sure he like came back in Venom. I'm pretty actually positive he came back in Venom. But it was a good issue, and hopefully I could get other issues. But it's in pretty good condition. Uh, there's a little bit of staining there, some chips. Um, it's occasional wear and everything. But other than that, it is a good book. It has a subscription crease as well. Or, uh, yeah, mailing crease, whatever you want to call it. Subscription crease. Fold right there. It's like a stain. But uh, it's still a really cool book. Issue number 26, Steve Dicko, Stan Lee. Um, you can only get one better than that, in my opinion, is Stanley and John Romita. So, hopefully, you guys enjoy this um, video. And uh, see you later, guys. Bye. Let's get off.